Hey guys, so um, today I wanted to talk to you about something, um, like, if you watched my first video, um, you know that I'm still in school, and we had this test, well it wasn't really a test, um, we got a piece of paper and two questions, and our teacher told us the question, um, class before the test, you know, as the class before, you know, the day before or something like that. So we had time to think about the questions and um, the question I picked was who am I? And that question really got me thinking and and I just wanted to share with you what I thought about it and actually I have what I wrote. I got it back and I'm just gonna read it for you like so you're just going to listen to my essay really, or essay, just the test, and yeah, so I'm just going to start and then I'm going to talk a little bit more about it. So I start by saying, I am Olina. Isn't that the answer everybody expects when, when you ask that question? Nobody really thinks a lot more about it than that. I'm still so much more than just my name. Um, I may not know myself who I am, really. I mean, I'm only 20 and I have my whole life ahead of me. Yes, don't I? Um, my life could end tomorrow or just in a few hours or in a few years. I don't know how long I'm gonna live. If I die tomorrow, will I just be old enough? No, maybe not. But still, I have been in school my entire life. I have really not done anything with my life, per se. Maybe that's the reason many people don't go to college. You have to be something, do something exciting. What would I know? I still have my story, my life. No one really thinks about it, I think. Well, I do sometimes. But more of the way, what do I want to do with my life? This is a good question though, and it's nice to wonder, who am I? I'm 20. I am have blonde, brunette sort of hair. I'm the girl that never says anything. In class, I'm the girl who does her assignments. I'm the girl that all of my friends look to and trust. I'm the girl that's good at baking and cooking and loves it. I'm the weird and quirky girl. I'm the girl that loves children and can't wait to be a mommy. I'm the girl that has only had one boyfriend and is engaged to him. I'm the responsible and working hard girl. I'm the girl with the heart defect um, and doesn't care. I'm the girl that isn't really scared of anything. That's what my friends and family would say about me if they would be asked. I on the, oh sorry, I on the other hand would say something completely different. I would say I'm the girl that suffers with depression. I'm the girl that has never been able to try very very hard physically because of her because of my heart defect. I'm the girl that has had two heart surgeries and two to three other minor surgeries revolving that. I'm the girl that's always been kind of fat and chubby. I'm the girl that needs to see every type of doctor there is at least once a year. I'm the girl that's always had to watch, watch what she's doing and watch herself because of her heart defect. I'm the girl that never, almost never has any money to do something and never has. I'm the poor girl. I'm the girl with 
so much family drama that it's the reason for my depression. I'm the girl that is scared to go up up in the morning because I'm sure I'm gonna mess something up. I am the girl that barely barely can say no. I'm the girl that's scared of fights. I'm the girl with bad attendance at school because I'm afraid to go. Um, I'm the girl who used to cut herself. I'm the girl who's working out, working out of all her bullshit. I'm the girl with a lot of stuff, a lot of trouble. That's the other side. That's my side. Said that me and my fiance know only really, even though he doesn't know everything. That's the side I don't want to have, but I'll, I will always have. That's the side that makes me strong. That's the side that I'm trying to bury as deep as I can to the ground, but I can't. But, you know, but because it keeps haunting me. That is me. You know. And, um, that's what I wrote. And if you were wondering, I got a 10 for this. Um, she thought it was very, very interesting. And, you know, a different take on the question. But, um, yeah. Have you ever really wondered who you are? Like, I mean, what do people think about you? When you're gone, what will people say? I mean, I don't know. I thought it was a special question and something worth thinking about. And I hope that you um, like what I had to say about it. And if you have any more questions, just comment down below. I'm willing to answer them. And I'll probably make a video answering all of the questions if you have any. And yeah, so that's all I want to say. So that's all for this video. Bye bye.